Hi, I'm Chef Candace Conley, and I'm going to show you how to make a Roquefort tart. There are a few steps to it, but I think you'll find in the end that it's all worth it. You have to make the crust to begin with. It's equal parts panko breadcrumbs to walnuts, and then you add in about two tablespoons of melted butter and whirl it in the food processor. Then you're going to put it in the bottom of a small springform pan and press it up the sides and press it into the bottom. Now for the filling. It is equal parts cream cheese to Roquefort cheese, two eggs, rosemary, chopped rosemary and prefer preferably fresh. If you use the dried, you're going to want to use a little bit less. Uh, in this recipe, it's a tablespoon of fresh chopped rosemary. If you only have dried, only use a teaspoon. Then you add salt and pepper and one minced clove of garlic. You stir it all up and then you pour it into the spring mold with the crust. Bake it in the oven at 350 for about 45 minutes, sometimes up to an hour, just until it's nice and brown and there's no movement. It's not like a regular cheesecake where you want it to see, where you want to see it jiggle in the middle. This one you want it to be solid. And if you follow all those steps, I think you'll find that it's a really great appetizer.